100 years ago today, one of the most pivotal moments in women's history was made right here in South Florida. A woman cast a vote in a local election for the first time ever south of the Mason Dixon line. Megan McRoberts was in Felsmere today with how that vote was made possible by legislative oversight. In the small town of Felsmere, one of the biggest moments in women's history took place 100 years ago. It's worth remembering. It was in 1915, five years before the 19th Amendment passed. Mrs. Zena Dreyer walked into the elections office in Felsmere and became the first woman to cast a ballot south of the Mason Dixon line. It was done with very little fanfare. And it happened basically by accident. In 1915, the city of Felsmere sent its charter to the state to be ratified, which included an addition to let women vote. Now, lawmakers were under a tight deadline, so they, not even the governor, noticed the change and it passed. She did it because she wanted to help build something for the future. Amelie Loy says Dreyer helped set the stage for her success and other women down the line. Loy later became the first woman in Felsmere to hold a public office in 1968. The beginnings of so many things can be traced back to women. Today joining in on the city's celebration to make sure everyone has their voice heard. We are so fortunate to live in a country like this. Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.